An average day in the life of a social worker in Devon uh, tends to be quite busy. You're on the go a lot. Um, lots of emails and messages. You get the corporate messages coming through, but also lots to do with your own caseload um, and changes within your teams, as you'll get anywhere, really. Um, if you like to be busy, if you like to be visiting different areas, you could be in the middle of a town one minute and five minutes down the road you're, you're surrounded by fields um, when you're not quite sure where you're going and you're stuck behind a tractor. Um, <laughs> so yeah, there's a, there's a lot of travel, um, always something going on and you get back to the office, you've got the time to write up the paperwork, depending on the size of your caseload, um, and you've got the access to the systems to do that. But yeah, each day tends to be pretty busy, pretty full on. <laughs> I tend to gravitate towards cases that involve um, dementia or they've got a mental health slant to them, doing a lot of 117 aftercare work with uh, colleagues in the mental health teams. Um, so yeah, but the, the work that, I, that our team tends to do is with adults aged 18 through to end of life um, and all points in between. There's lots of varying physical disabilities that you can come across. Um, we've merged with the Learning Disability Service and teams, so we're coming across more and more people with learning disabilities. Um, so yeah, there's, there's all sorts, lots of acquired brain injuries. Um, so yeah, there's lots going on.